From the Texas Hill Country at Horseshoe Bay to the Sand Hills of North Carolina at Pinehurst, site of the 2014 U.S. Open Championships, all golf courses have one thing in common. Their plain surface is turf grass. One of the cool things about being on a golf course is, is the playing surface that you're on is living. Golf course superintendents and turf grass managers use science and technology in the practice of agronomy to create an ideal environment for golf. No matter where you are in the country, you want to make sure that you are selecting the grass that's going to be best suited for the environmental conditions that you have. All green plants, including grasses, require sunlight, oxygen, carbon dioxide, water, and nutrients. Golf course superintendents base their fertilization programs on soil tests in order to accurately apply the proper amount that the plant needs. This tool, called a soil profiler, takes a cross-section of a putting green to allow the manager to examine the roots and any potential layering or organic matter buildup in the soil. Each one of those layers changes the way water and nutrients move down through the profile. By employing agronomic principles and maintenance practices, golf courses not only become beautiful places to be, but also venues where championship history is made. All right on top of a living plant.